Today we're going to be checking out the Sony 20-70G lens. This lens is Sony's replacement for the 24-70 f4 Zeiss lens and it offers a really good mid-range zoom, especially because you've actually got that 20 range opposed to 24. From experience from using the 20 to 70, it is a really, really good lens and it is designed around vloggers. So having the ability to change that camera around, looking at yourself um, and having that extra angle of view, it's really useful for that kind of aspect of it. Um, the other side of it is that it does feel really nice, lightweight and incredibly reliable. The autofocus was pretty amazing pretty much through all of the shoot and it is a lens that I would ultimately recommend. The lens does have a high grade plastic construction but I've got to say it feels just right in the hands and at the end of the day when you are trying to create lenses these days you got to make sure that they're light so people can either choose to have more lenses or if you're looking to use it for traveling uh, around the world doing vlogs and stuff like that you lighten the load especially when you're considering the weight kind of tolerance of your bag for things like airplanes and stuff like that uh, and at the end of the day you've got to make sure that your gear um, can do everything that you want it to do but you also need to be able to carry that gear around and this lens has a great kind of like midfield option for people that want to have a lens that covers the basis in the mid-range that you want it to um, and also be incredibly versatile so that's my opinions check out the lens uh, make sure if you are looking to buy the lens click the link in the description it just shows that these videos are helping people you know pick the lens yeah that's pretty pretty good Today we're planning on taking this lens out in Cardiff. Uh, the weather is a little bit bad today, so we're gonna be trying it out in some of the arcades and markets, and I hope you enjoy the video. Hey, uh, here with the uh, 2070 in front of Cardiff Castle. It is absolutely shocking weather today. So we're gonna be trying a few uh, photos out here and then going in and around some of the arcades just to see what the lens is like. So this lens is incredibly well made. It feels really good in the hands, the zoom controls, the aperture control. Big thing about the new Sony lenses is that they've actually designed them really around pretty much any creative with the customization of the buttons here as well, as well as having that D-click aperture ring. So this lens is designed for vloggers, so people that wanna take a look at themselves like this. So it's a very versatile lens, and that's what you're looking at ranges like this, is to have a lens that can pretty much do everything. So this is uh, the angle that you'll see when you actually use the lens on the camera. This is at the 20 mil range. We've got uh, Tylo in the back there. Hello. Hi. And it's uh, really simple and easy to control with just one hand. Like this is my other hand and then zoom in on my face. There you go. This lens is kind of designed for vloggers in this retrospect and it is incredibly stable with the internal stabilization of the camera itself, but it actually gives you a great point of view and a great ability to do like a Casey zoom if you want to. So like, hello, that's me. And then I'm back out like that. So if you're looking to tell stories via vlogging, you have that ability with this lens. And like I said, the, when it comes to these kind of range, when you're looking at the 2470 or the 20 to 70, you've got a range there that's designed for pretty much every case. So a big thing when it comes to like f4 lenses and especially at this range is that you may actually want to use an f2.8 um, because uh, some of the other brands offer f2.8s at a similar sort of price point but what you really want to see is kind of like the focus you get off of the lenses so this has nine aperture blades inside of it and it has actually got some really nice bokeh Ooh, in the way So we've just been to the Castle Arcade. Now we are in the Cardiff Market, going indoors today again because of that weather. Uh, the photos came out pretty cool. I really like this lens. However, here I'm going to be focusing a little bit more on video to show some of the autofocus, so some of the more other kind of bits of shooting. like follow and subscribe to see more make sure you uh, hit notifications click that little bell um, and I look forward to seeing you next time my name's Stuart and this is Camera Center UK